Hi everyone and welcome to challenge three. If you, if this is the first time you're joining us, don't worry, you can catch up on all the other challenges so far. If you go underneath the videos, you'd be able to see the previous challenges. So today's challenge is to write a program that will accept a user's name and the current day in December. It'll use the input to calculate and print out Merry Christmas name in capital letters, followed by there are X days until Christmas. OK, so with a problem like this, I like to split them up um, into two sections. So the first thing I'm going to do is work out how to print out Merry Christmas in capital letters. So to do that, I will type print, then my brackets, then a double quote, and type Merry Christmas. So to make things uppercase, you use the dot upper function, and it's important here that you add these brackets on the end. So if I run that, I can see on my right hand side that it's printed Merry Christmas in capital letters. If I forget those brackets on the end of upper and run that again, you can see it's not doing anything. It's not doing what we want. So whenever you're using dot upper to make your um, your string uppercase, it needs those brackets on the end. The same with dot lower. So you can see on the right, um, upper or lower works, but you always need to make sure you have these brackets on the end. OK, so I've got Merry Christmas in uppercase. Now I need to do Merry Christmas plus a name. So what I'm going to do is create a variable called name. And that's going to equal input brackets. And then I'm going to ask the user, what is your name? I'm going to put a slash n on the end so that when it asks my when the computer asks for the name, it'll ask it on the second line. When I get that name, I'm going to concatenate it onto my print statement. So once I've made a little change to my code, I'm going to run it and see if it works. So you can see now that the cursor is on the next line because I've put the slash n here. So now that it's asking my name, I can type it in. And it's say Merry Christmas, Sophia, all in one word. So all I just need to do is put a space on the end here. I'll run that again, type in my name again, and now we're getting Merry Christmas Sophia all in uppercase. So the, now for the next part of the problem. So we need to get the input of the current day in December, and then we're going to calculate and print out there are X days until Christmas. Okay, so we're getting another input. This time it's going to be the current day in December, so I will call this variable day in deck and then an equal sign. And because I'm going to do some maths with this, I'm going to have to cast this to an integer. So I do int, then input, then I can ask what day in December is it? And I'll put that slash n again on the end. So when the computer asks, it'll go onto the new line for me to enter. So now that I'm getting the user to input the day, I'm going to now do the maths to work out how many days are left until Christmas. So I'll create a new variable called days left in deck. And that is going to equal 25 minus days day in deck. So what I'm doing here is whatever the user inputs as the day, so let's say it's the third today, I'll do 25 minus today, which would be three, and then we know there's 22 days left until Christmas. So now that I've done the maths, I can print that out. So I'll use another print function and type there are with a space, add, and now I can put my 
variables days left in deck and then add the second part of the sentence which is days left until Christmas. So now that I've written this code let me run it to see if it works. Okay so we can see here that there's a big red line um, and we've got an error and the the reason is is this days left in deck variable is an integer but I'm trying to add it to a string so I need to remember to cast it to a string to do that I type the letters str and put the whole variable in brackets and again if I for every start in bracket I need an end bracket so let's run that again okay we can also see that my print I've got one on the row the wrong way around so I just need to re-add my brackets and we can try that again and now it looks like it's working so I'll add my name and it's the 3rd of December today so I'll put three and now I'm getting both my statements together so it's Merry Christmas Sophia there are 22 days left until Christmas so I'll run that again I'll add a different name and a different date and we can see that it's still working so that is challenge three I hope you've all had a go and if not you can re-watch this video back on YouTube and you can have a go you can change it up um, from the the question any way you like Jake will be here tomorrow to take you through challenge four see you bye